Hello everyone, I am the Great Zarin. I have been quiet on this channel for too long. But whatever. I have reason to be back now. The newest slam crate for larger than life. And this is a big box. Appropriate for this theme for July and August, I think. Or August and September. Some pair of months. I forgot what it is now. <coughs> I had this for a couple of days. I just now decided to. Well, I just now had the time to do it. So let's open this up and see what there is for larger than life. There went men like Undertaker and Braun Strowman. Two things I'm not surprised with. Cool. I'll show you the lid in a moment. But first thing I see is the shirt. Undertaker. Lazy. This is a really cool looking shirt. If you're gonna have big men, you gotta talk about Undertaker, of course. So I'll show you the lid next. Shows you Alexa Bliss, Andre the Giant, another big man you gotta talk about, Undertaker, Braun Strowman. <laughs> Next up is the other thing that I'm not surprised with it's the Braun Strowman figure. <laughs> also, saw that uh, at some point they had people vote on it. It was a choice between, I can't remember who it was, it was between three people, it was between Roman Reigns, Chris Jericho, and somebody else, Chris Jericho won. So, I wasn't getting slam crates, so normally it's not that slam crate, but Chris freaking Jericho in it. So this is the fourth in their second series of these figures. So, next time they'll start the next series. Bro! Awesome. There's a tattoo on the inside of his arm that says "Save of North Carolina" that says "Country Strong." They've got that. That's a minor detail, but that's awesome. That really is awesome. And as always, they've got the little things except a quarter of the ring that stand for them. I was like, "Boys, I'm gonna try to freaking set it up." Next up. Some deal with the Million Dollar Championship, it looks like. It's got that, which is the face plates, the various plates for the Million Dollar Championship. There we go. This is referencing Andre, because I think. Did Andre have it? I'm pretty sure Andre had it. I think I know what this is. I believe, if I can get it out, I believe this is a money clip. Ah! That was probably a horrible million dollar man laugh. <coughs> Too having mucus stuck in my throat for some reason. But anyway, yes, I'm almost certain this is a money clip. And, I mean, it's a million dollar championship. Next time, probably Vince McMahon's face on it. I mean, this is probably the best money clip you can get for it. That's WWE themed. Next up. Is the WCW World Championship. Which, yeah, I think when they did the NWO variant of this, I griped about it and griped about it again. If you look at the details of this, so I'm not sure this camera can show it, it says WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Wait, World Heavyweight Wrestling Champion. Yeah, it's got the WWE freaking logo on it, which annoys me. Me being the historical little nerd that I am, it's like, that's not right. It didn't say WWE at the time. It probably didn't have WWE's logo on it. It was just a big gold belt. But anyway. Next up, this is potentially the thing that causes this box to be so big, is a blanket. Of something. There we go. Also, they delayed this crate because something didn't show up in time. 
They keep having that problem, but they keep being honest about it, so, alright, so... Andre the Giant is on a blanket. It's a big blanket, too. Good lord almighty. I have to back up for a second. According to what this blanket is saying, I'm going to take another word. Exactly how big Andre the Giant's foot was. Good lordy. Now it's not the height of who he was, but there's still enough room to show how big his hand was in actuality. Good lord. And it's got weight seven foot four, weight five hundred twenty five pounds. He was a giant. Neck twenty four inches, chest seventy one inches, biceps twenty one, forearm seventeen, wrist eleven inches, hand probably sixteen inches across, thighs thirty six inches, calves twenty two, and shoe size of twenty four. I have a nine and a half. <clears throat> awesome. Very awesome. Now let's put that there for the moment. And the last thing is the booklet that comes with it. Ah, here we are. So, I mentioned a moment ago that they had a little like three-way thing for who was going to be a, a fourth slam star figure, I guess. Since this is the fourth one in this series. They're going to be starting their third series of them, so I guess it'd be one of these three, and it was Chris Jericho, which is awesome. Okay, so, in this crate, the Undertaker t-shirt, the Slam Star Braun Strowman collectible figure, Andre the Giant Fleece Blanket, uh, Million Dollar Money Clip, I was right, because what else are you going to do with this? What else is going to be a money clip in WWE, or in wrestling in general? There's every World Championship pen. Why are you talking about it? But from 2002 to 2013, WCW World Heavyweight WCW Heavyweight Championship was held by some of the biggest stars in WWE. Don't call it the World. Just call. It. If you're gonna talk about the World Heavyweight Championship, give us the World Heavyweight Championship pen. Don't call it the. WCW Heavyweight Championship. It was what it was called after a while. It was called the World Heavyweight Championship. I know, I'm being a wrestling nerd. It's minor things that get me. Interview this month, or in this crate, was Braun Strowman. Pancakes or waffles? Chipotle quesadillas. So that's just one of the answers. Ooh, good poster for larger than life. It's Braun Strowman flying through the air, which is scary for a six foot eight man. About to be punched by Big Show, another legendary big man slash giant. I believe the next crate is better than you. It's already showing stuff like Elias, so it's going to be a lot of probably people who are one to walk to walk and could talk, or at least could talk, and hopefully could back it up sometimes. Other times, maybe not so much. But, you know, this might be an Elias shirt or something. But as always, if you're interested in a slam crate or a loot crate, go to those sites. Hopefully, I won't be. I'll put the links to those in the description. So, yeah, I'm going to have to put that shirt in the laundry basket to be washed next time I do laundry, and need to find a place for all the stuff. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.